A survivor of the 1945 atomic bombing of Hiroshima is hoping that group of seven leaders will contemplate the dangers of nuclear weapons when they meet here next year. Tanaka Toshiko, an 84-year-old who works as an enameling artist, has set up space in her home where people can communicate with each other. She was sharing stories about her experience with university students from Tokyo when we visited. Tanaka was about 2.3 kilometers from ground zero when the United States dropped the bomb on the western Japanese city. あの、this photo was taken when Tanaka's class graduated from kindergarten five months before the bombing. Her classmates are believed to have died in the blast at a local elementary school while she escaped the fate as her family moved to a different neighborhood just six days earlier. This summer, Tanaka received a video from Tamara Krizitskaya, who heads a group of sufferers of the Chernobyl disaster. The two met when Tanaka took part in a peace boat tour in which she spoke in more than 90 countries and territories, including Ukraine. Ми пережили Чорнобиль і ось вдруге покинули свої домівки через війну. After Russia invaded Ukraine, she evacuated to Germany. She is asking Tanaka to talk about the horrors of nuclear weapons as a hibakusha, the Japanese term for atomic bomb survivor. Що я відчувала, коли дізналась про загрозу Росії використати атомну зброю проти України? Звичайно, жах. І не тільки я, але весь світ розуміє наслідки використання атомної зброї. Дорога Танака Сан, ви і хібакуші не можете мовчати. Нехай всі знають, що їх чекає. Я і цікітимо. なんか胸がね、いっぱいになりますね。生き残ったものの、やっぱりこれ責任、責務だなと改めて思いますね。あの、これしかないですよね。核兵器使うとどんなことが起こるか、ま、人類の滅亡に繋がってるんだよということをね